What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the San Diego Padres versus Washington Nationals Major League Baseball matchup going down Monday, June 24th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. Also, make sure you check out my 2024 Major League Baseball Grand Slam season pass. This is for the betters that are betting $1,000 or more per game on Major League Baseball this season. But what it's going to get you access to is the weighting and rating of my plays for the first time. You're going to know where my biggest bets on the board are. It's also going to get you access to my Nerfies and Nerfies and my first five plays, as well as plays I make throughout the day based on things like line moves, money moves, pitching changes, and lineup changes. Right now, if that's like something you're interested in. That's the kind of bankroll that you're working with. Text Grand Slam to 443-780-5663. We'll get you some more information. But let's get to this one. Between the San Diego Padres and the Washington Nationals, the San Diego Padres sending out Matt Waldron for the start in this one, while the uh, excuse me, while the Nationals will counter with Patrick Corbin. Now, you know, the thing for me with, with, with Matt Waldron is that he was a hard pitcher for me to really get a gauge for early on in the year, but, you know, he's pitched really well in his last few starts, you know. Didn't doesn't have the greatest numbers at Petco, but I think a lot of those just have to do with some inconsistencies and shorter starts earlier this season. But he, he only has a four point three six ERA and a two and four record at home, whereas his ERA on the road two two point eight six. But you look at some of the recent outings for for Matt Waldron. You know he hasn't given up uh, more than two earned runs in any of his last five starts. You have the last time he gave up more than two runs in a start, you have to go back to May fifth, where he gave up eight runs, seven earned. Um, on eight hits over three innings work against the Arizona Diamondbacks. He's got a 1.71 ERA in the month of June. And like I said, he's just pitching extremely well right now. And the Padres, five and two in his last seven starts as a team. Again, we'll have to see if he can sort of replicate that success getting back home here. And I think he can. You know, the Washington Nationals, <clears throat> this is a, a, a tough spot for the Nationals. You know, coming back from their Coors Field series without a day off to sort of get the bodies right after being in the altitude. And the, you know, Petco can be a tough place to go on the road and hit. The Washington Nationals, their numbers against right handed pitching are around league average at the best of times over the last, uh, the last two weeks. And, you know, I think that the Nationals just have some issues here against Waldron. On the other side, you know, the, the Padres, for the better part of the season, have had issues against lefties. And Patrick Corbin, these are words I never thought I'd put in the same sentence as Patrick Corbin, but back to back, five inning, one run starts. So maybe he's turning the corner. Who knows? And the Padres are only hitting 229 against lefties in the last two weeks. But they're just outside the top 10 in Team OPS. The isolated power numbers are solid as well. And bottom line, full stop, I don't trust Patrick Corbin as far as I can throw him. He's got, still got a road ERA around 5.5. You know, the Nationals have had issues winning games and starts. Why? Because he puts his team behind the eight ball with how many runs he gives up more often than not in his starts. And I think the Padres can get to Corbin early and often here. I think it's going to be hard for Corbin to match zeros with, with Matt Waldron here. So I'm going to go with the San Diego Padres in this one. And that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.